Hello, today I want to talk to you about this Ming Yue. It belonged to Earl Kitchener of Khartoum and is in the inventory of 1916 at Broome Park where he lived by Christy Manson Wood, where it's described as a Yue with fountains, Persian taste, early type, and it's actually in the hall at Broome Park. Fascinating. Made during the reign of Jia Jing, 1522 to 1566, this emperor was preoccupied with the ideas of immortality. By drinking from the magic fountain, one could live forever without ever growing old. In the mid 17th century, these ewers were also prized objects among Europeans, as can be seen in a ewer bearing the magic fountain motif in a still life oil painting by Willem Kauf circa 1660, in the museum in Madrid. The shape is inspired by Middle Eastern brass pictures, but where does the design come from? The chile crouched beneath the fountain, the flames on the spout and handle, and the lappet decoration on the foot and mouth, all very Chinese. Jessica Harrison Hall suggests that ewers of this type may have been commissioned by Jesuits who lived in Macau from the mid 16th century, and some were involved in the Chinese porcelain industry. There is another ewer in the Topkapi Sarai Museum, and here Regina Kral and John Ayers list the different academics and their views about the origin of this design, which we have quoted if you look on our website. Altogether, a fascinating object, a ewer with a past. The research goes on. By the way, on the base, there's a hair, and it's thought that the hair lives on the moon and grinds the drugs of immortality.